Kylie Jenner, the youngest of the Kardashian Jenner clan, was first known for her work on Keeping Up with the Kardashians, where she showcased talents such as this. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Young Kylie had a huge personality. She was funny and outgoing, but it seems like ages since we saw the preteen acting like that. She has since made waves with her controversial lip injections and broke the internet with her new look. What's going on, guys? My name is Stella Nicole, and this is Before and After Transformations. As always, I would love to hear from you guys, so let me know who you want me to document next in the comments down below. You can always hit me up on my Instagram page at Stella Nicole. Now, let's get started. It's hard to believe this brunette beauty had anything to be insecure about growing up. When looking at older pictures of her, Kylie dressed simple, wearing no makeup and went for a more natural look. Looking back at these older pictures of her, she actually looked her age for once and I must say she was pretty cute. But as Kylie grew up, so did her assets. One of the most talked about topics for Kylie was her lips. Kylie has openly said that the way her lips looked has always been an insecurity of hers. Dating back to middle school, she states, This guy I kissed was like, your lips are really small but you're a really good kisser. I didn't think you were going to be a good at kissing. I felt like no one wanted to kiss me. Ouch. Kylie went on to explain that when a guy you have a crush on says something like that, it can really affect you. She didn't feel desirable or pretty and she wanted bigger lips. It's hard to not have empathy for the poor girl. Kylie Jenner made her debut in the spotlight, appearing on Keeping Up with the Kardashians when she was only 10 years old. Over the course of a few years, she grew up in front of her eyes and has become both an Instagram star and a beauty icon. Let's take a look at what she used to look like before the transformation happened. Here we have Kylie in 2009 and she was just 12 years old and I'm loving the freckles on her. We we barely get to see those under all the layers of foundation she wears all the time, which is such a shame to not show them off. I would die to have freckles like that. Here we have Kylie at the premiere of Project X in 2012 and you can tell she's starting to grow into herself. She has beautiful hair, lips and eyes and she looks stunning without the lip injections. She still looks super natural at this point and very age appropriate. Here we have Kylie at the MTV Movie Awards in 2013. Before Kylie became famous for her curves, she was a lot thinner here and didn't seem to have an hourglass figure. Since that time, Kylie's appearance has changed changed drastically. She looks like a completely different person. She's now best known for her enhanced lips and hourglass figure. Although admitting to having lip injections done, rumors have now circulated on the internet surrounding her new curves. Kylie claims that her curvier look, breasts and bum are simply due to a natural weight gain and not cosmetic surgery. She states that she used to be 120 pounds at the age of 16 and now she weighs 136 pounds. The internet has also claimed that she has changed her jawline, nose and eyebrow lift. Let's take a closer look at Kylie's face, starting with her lips. Although she admitted to having them done, I'd still like to compare her old lips to her new ones. In this image here, Kylie Jenner at the 2014 Billboard Music Awards, this is the start of when people started noticing a difference in Kylie Jenner's lips. Although around this time, Kylie claims she was overdrawing her lips, there seems to be way more surface area in her lips now. If you look close enough, you can see a few lumps and bumps which points to the direction of fillers. In this image here, Kylie Jenner at the 2014 launch of Kylie Hair Couture, Kylie stated in an interview that at one point she had overdone her lips and she looked crazy. That's when she decided to change injectors, which in turn made her have a more softer look. I'm guessing by the look of the lips in this picture, this was probably before she had made the switch. Her lips look extremely overdone here and the dark lipstick is not helping. Fast forward to Kylie's lips at the Met Gala in 2017 and her lips appear to look softer and more natural. I really do love her lips now and how they look, they fit her face perfectly and I do think it completes her look. Kylie recommends using Juvederm because it only lasts 3-4 to four months and you're not permanently stuck with the shape or the filler. Now let's move on to Kylie's nose. Now I've been on the fence about it, how she got a nose job, is it just really good contour? There's been speculation that Kylie has received rhinoplasty as the tip of her nose looks a lot more refined and is not drooping as much in older pictures. It has been said that her nose looks pinched at the tip, making her nose look less bulky. Let's take a look at some before and afters of Kylie's nose. So in this image here, the bridge of her nose is what stands out to me the most. It looks a little bit more narrowed and her tip looks the same but it could also very well be contour. Now let's move on to Kylie's jawline. Looking at this image, there's always rumors that Kylie had surgery to correct her jaw and give her a more contoured jawline. I'm on the fence about this as well, as Kylie addresses these rumors by saying, I've always used to love my jaw, I was never self conscious about my jaw but before I got my lips done, my lips were tiny and were more like sunken in, so my chin seemed more pronounced. You really think Kris Jenner will let a 16 year old let me have a cheek and jaw reconstructive surgery? No. I wouldn't use Kris Jenner as someone to reference in this case, after all she did build an empire on her daughter's sex tape and although 
what Kylie says does make sense. She could be lying since she's lied for so long about her lip injections. When looking at these pictures side by side, her chin does look like it has been shaped more and there seems to be a slight contour in the jawline. I don't think it's surgery but it could be fillers which helps create this look or just really good makeup. Let's talk Kylie's eyebrow game. Now looking at this before and after picture, you can tell there's a slight lift in the eyebrow. I'm betting Botox because it definitely creates that look. Now let's talk about Kylie's curves. In this image here, Kylie at the 2014 Billboard Awards, Kylie was still looking super natural at this point and nothing really drastically has changed. This image seen in August of 2016, here you can see her breasts have increased dramatically in size. With her very slim figure, it's unlikely it's natural. Kylie is denying getting breast augmentation stating no people, I haven't gotten breast implants. Everyone is obsessed with that. Truth is, I've gotten older, I've gained 15 pounds, and my body has changed. I've definitely filled out. I want to show you guys some more images here, and I'm sorry, but this girl needs to come out already with the fact that she got her boobs done. You can tell in each of these photos that they are definitely not natural. They look great, don't get me wrong, but blaming your perfect boobs on weight gain or that time of the month is it's not gonna cut it. Let's move on to her butt and waist. Here she has a body like any young teenager would have. All natural looking, breasts and hips are that of an average person. So looking at this image here, I want to start off by saying her body looks incredible. And it's hard to believe that this was all from weight gain though. I mean she does admit that she never works out ever. And if you follow her on snapchat, you know she doesn't eat the healthiest either with all that fried shrimp. Now when we gain weight naturally, it doesn't end up in the places we want to. As much as I want it to, it sure as hell doesn't. Now Kylie has the perfect hourglass shape, although she denies having any work done, she could have gone a fat transfer which allows you to sculpt your body by removing the fat from one area and transferring it to the other. I feel like this is the route she went because she was openly admitted to never working out in her life and puberty plus weight gain does not result in the perfect hourglass shape, no matter how hard we try or wish. So now let's move on to pregnant Kylie. Now Kylie gave birth to baby Stormy on February 1st and looking at her pregnancy photos, she does look radiant and beautiful. Now during her pregnancy, she did gain 40 pounds and we do know that since Kylie doesn't work out or eat healthy before her pregnancy, she sure didn't start while carrying Stormy. Now she does mention that she was craving in and out burgers and waffles. Now that's a lot different than how her sister Chloe is taking care of herself during her pregnancy. Now Kylie posted this snapchat video one month after having Stormy and her stomach looks amazing. I guess it's a lot easier to bounce back when you're as young as her and having a baby. As for the rest of this body transformation, well we'll have to wait and see until Kylie decides to make new changes to her body that will stir up the internet. Now until next time, this is before and after transformations. My name is Stella Nicole and thanks for watching this video. Let me know who you want me to document next and you can reach me via my Instagram page at Stella Nicole. Bye guys. Young Kylie had a huge personality. She was young. Oh my god, obviously she was young because she's not old. Young Kylie was so young. Young Kylie was young and old Kylie is old. Okay, let's do that again. You can also hit me up on my Instagram page at Stella Nicole. I f***ed that up. Instagram. <laughs> Instagram. What kind of accent is that? I don't even know.